Hello and welcome back, Zevlin here. Let's play a little bit more of our Nigar playthrough in European vs. Alice 4. Now, right as I click the button here, being at speed 5, it goes really, really fast. Miwar! Peaced out. They did take, I think, two provinces? No, just one province here. Yeah, right? No. Two. Yeah. Two provinces here. Uh, guitar did. Guitar. <laughs> Geharat. Which means that they are pretty much free. Well, this sucks. Look, they're, they're sieging my crap. That's not good. Anyway, there's nothing we can do about that. Let's just get moving here. Now, my missionary is just about done. And as soon as he's done, which is just right now, I get the Religious Unity mission. And I believe I may get it again once I super piece here. I'm taking this province. I'm taking all their money. I'm taking war reparations. I think that's it, right? I don't care about anything else. I mean, I could vassalize them on top of this. It cost me 50 extra diplo points. You know what? I really should. That would make me a lot more powerful. It saved me the hassle of having to fight them again. I do want to take one of their provinces, though. Because, first of all, I have a claim on it. Um, and second of all, that means they'll be smaller than me instead of bigger than me. And I'd rather be the bigger... I don't... Yeah, I don't want to vassalize someone who's bigger than me. That's, that's That can get tricky. So we're going to send this just like that. Okay, so I now have a vassal, and let's click these. I'm never going to, pretty much never going to take a peace deal that they write up. It's never going to be good. Improve relations with them. Um, well, it's only three prestige. Let's let some time tick. Maybe, no, it didn't. I was hoping it would give me the religious unity thing. Okay, peace offer here. I may be able to take this. Hold on. What kind of... Rajput Patriots. What happens, because what this may do, because my culture is Rajput, they may actually force this to me. So I may just go ahead and piece them out, let them deal with the Patriots. So I'm a little afraid that if I piece this out, then I'll have to deal with the Patriots. Because they won't move on to sieging. So I should go over here and siege for now. Maybe let them take that and see if it flips to me. Oh, they broke their alliance with me? Oh, they have a domineering attitude towards me. That is not good. That's kind of scary, actually. Enclave of Infidels. Gain piety for losing ducats. Yeah, I have to do that. All right, next thing I have to do is go ahead and start coring this. Man, so many people have a claim on that. That's a little scary. Um, any shot at alliance? If I wasn't at war, yes, actually. So that means I can go ahead and grab a royal marriage with you at least. Did I end up with a claim here? I do have a claim here. So let's see if, if I can take this. Hold on, what's this? Peace offer from Miwar, peace offer from... They can piece separately? I can piece these guys separately? I thought they were a vassal. I can full annex them. I think I may need to do that. How much money? Ooh, you have some money. War reparations. And vassalize? Do I, do I want to vassalize them? I mean, I yeah, I think vassalizing them may be the right goal. It does eat up a diplomatic rep, uh, relation spot. But it gives me money. And 
I don't have to pay to core them. Uh, it it will cost me Diplo points in the long run. This is costing me Diplo points now. I think this is the better route. Let's do that. Hey, look at that. Those rebels are suddenly friendly to me. So that's good. Though I am probably gaining tons of aggressive expansion. I haven't even really considered that yet. Yeah, I already have 27 aggressive expansion. Yeah, not so much up here. Not so much there either. I'm a little afraid of them now, though. Peace off from me, War. No, I don't really want to. Though, I don't know. Vassalizing them would actually be very nice. I have claims on two of their things. I think I'd be better off just taking them and coring them. Having too many vassals can be bad. Though this could flip to me without aggressive expansion. If their rebels are just successful. Rajput. Rajput. So this could be a risky move. But what I could do is just piece them out by taking, you know, just take all their money all that nonsense, not actually take any land so I don't get aggressive expansion and really hope that these rebels are successful though it looks like they're not going to be taking their capital it is Rajput, so that is a little strange that it's they're not gain mercantilism yeah, I'm going to gain mercantilism mercantilism is good Improve relations, form an alliance with um, Gajarat. It's probably not going to happen. Yeah, the domineering attitude thing. That's that's bad. I have rebels that are peasants, right here. They're only fifty percent. What is it that you're doing exactly, Rebels? Alright, let's look. You're at 5 War Exhaustion. This is going to be a heck of a lot of aggressive expansion. Um, if I take both of these, it's 7 aggressive expansion. So that's 18 for Miwar. That's me what? Don't care don't care about them. Um Jangladesh and Let's see what what's really important? How much is it for Gir Gijarat? I'll never be able to say that right. Gijarat. I just need to take them over so I don't have to say their name anymore. It will actually only be five more with them. What about Delhi? You know what? It doesn't really affect anybody I care about. It just affects these little tiny countries. So I'm just going to take it. it. Gives me a chance to take some money and war reparations. Make the Manal Treaties for some prestige. May as well. Okay. Sounds good to me. And then maybe, now that I'm at... Is this actually under siege? No, well, there are just random rebels standing here. Interesting. Alright. I can make rivals. Delhi... Jarrat, who are... I have no enemies. Hmm. So because I vassalize, I get plus three. Because I don't have enough, I lose three. Alright. Well, I definitely need to gain some then. Rival of a threat. Malwa. Any shot? Oh, yeah. Malwa would be a good ally. I suppose. Uh, 
Um, let's go ahead and grab an alliance from Wanpur, just for defensive purposes. And let's grab this rival of a threat mission here. Royal marry them. Then in a month I can grab an alliance from them as well. So I'll be a little bit more defended. In the meantime, let's core all the things so I'm not so overextended. Let's grab some rivals. Now, this is a one province miner and I can make them a rival. That seems smart to me. I can make... Miwar a rival. I just took a bunch of crap from them. It would have been nice to have them rivaled beforehand. Mawa? No. Miwat? No. I don't really want to piss them off. Um, I don't really want to piss off Delhi. Except for Wanpur is currently kicking their... But, hold on. Yeah, you're... Holy crap, yeah. Delhi's getting its butt kicked, so maybe they should be my rival. Kathawar, who are you? Um... That's this little country down here. There's really no point in me rivaling them. Okay, I guess it's Delhi who has a way bigger army than me. No, I don't really want to do that. May as well... How can I twist this to help me? Miwar, Malwa, Bahiminis. Well, with Malwa, I've pretty much sealed the deal here. Really? They're rivaled to Miwar? A tiny little place? That's... Yeah, hmm. I could get an alliance from Send. So I don't want to do that. Alright, I have to just pick somebody. So we're going to do Kathwar just for somebody. Somebody that's a little weaker than me. And... Miwat's not going to exist very long, much longer. God, I almost just want to... rival... these guys. It's really the only choice. I guess Miwar... Me where it is. They're weak. Alright, so rivals. I need to... Alliance offer from Mawa. Yes. Um, yeah, you can have access. Issue embargo. We have a truce, so we can't embargo them. Crap, who else did I just... These guys. Issue Embargo. Bam. So I get a little bit of power projection. Which gives me a little bit more trade power, a little bit more morale. Alright. New Air. 302. Not great. Oh, 333. Wait, what? What? How'd I get two new heirs? Anyway, 333 is way better than a 302, so we'll take that. And... Yeah, we'll just take that. That's fine. I'm gaining zero Diplo power <laughs> per month. Um, that's not good. I have six of four relations. Hold on, hold on. Royal marriage with somebody I don't really want to be allied to. Miwat won't exist much longer. Yeah, they're all sealed by royal marriages. That's not good. Okay. 
keep my maintenance up a little bit. Uh, Rebel Nagarian Peasants. Is that all of these places? It is, unfortunately. That's going to pop really, really fast. You know what? I am going to raise autonomy in these places. I mean, that's going to suck for money. But I can't really afford to have these rebels pop up right now. How much will harsh treatment will only cost? I'm just going to go ahead and do this now. I don't want to forget about it and have them go. I'm going to go ahead and do it one more time, actually. Just get it down so I can forget about it. I can't boost stability because it's way too expensive. But once we get some cores rolling in, we can start. There's a core. We can start converting. Now that's not going to help out my rubble case very much. Crap, I already forgot. What is my mission? Malwa's opinion. Malwa. Malwa likes me quite a bit. Am I improving relations with them? Improve relations. Miwat still in its war against Delhi, Jangle. Yeah. Delhi, Miwat, Jampur. Hey, they may have a shot at winning that. Probably not. But if they still are around, I might be able to vassalize them. see what kind of trouble would I get myself into if I attacked them Cathawar huh allied with Cathawar where are you Cathawar you're them I don't I don't know it might be worth it there's my mission achieve religious unity yes that is definitely the mission I want to do. All right. Okay, they like me a fair bit. I hate this domineering attitude thing. Um, we're gonna stop improving relations with them. I have things to do with my diplomats. All right, they are still independent. Let's start improving relations with them. Um, we can stop improving relations with you. I want a claim here, just in case. I have an opportunity to go to war with you. More importantly, I need to get my stability, general stability, not actual stability, though that would be helpful too. Military coalition. What? I'm talking nonsense right now. 40 aggressive expansion, okay. That makes sense. Um, repay loans, no, I'm losing money. So I don't really want to repay loans right now. So, luckily we have a little bit of a buffer. There's two more cores. Royal marriage from Hadoti, which is my vassal, right? Yes, let's go ahead and do that. Target practice. Five peasants. Alright. Raise maintenance back up. What province? Ajmer. So let's march down there. Let's grab ourselves a leader. He's not too bad. Three shock. And I'm just going to let this pop naturally. I'm not going to actually push the button. I'm just going to, because the longer I wait, the more morale I'm going to have. Having the slider all the way up gives me the offensive morale. But I may as well wait for the defensive morale. Brigands strike at pilgrims. Uh, there's a claim. Yes, revolt. Of course it fired. I should be able to win this fairly easily. It wasn't quite as easily as I hoped, but I forget I do have vassals. 
All right, Brigand Strike at Pilgrims. Gain piety and prestige, yes. Absolutely. All right, my missionary is just about done here. I think I can lower maintenance again. Oh, I'm actually making a little bit of money. Repay loans? Yeah. There we go. And with the loan repaid and no missionary working, I'm actually making money again. But I do need my missionary to <laughs> keep working. Two years for each one of these. Not too bad. We'll go pretty fast, I think. I actually have negative revolt risk here now, which is great. So once I actually convert these places, we'll be fine as far as revolt risk goes. So hopefully this won't pop within the next four years. If it if it looks like it's going to be close, I will buy down the... Mili with, use military power to buy that down again. I really don't want to... How am I doing? Whoa, am I seriously making zero trade? How am I making nothing from trade? We have no embargoes on us. What? Oh. Am I not collecting from trade here? What is going on here? Collect. You, collect. Three days. I'm collecting nothing. Why am I collecting nothing? You understand why I'm not collecting anything up here. I don't have anything in that trade node. So I'm actually going to move him down here. I'm making money here. Why can't I collect from trade here? Absent merchant. Oh, that might be it for seven more years. Um, well, there's not much I can do about that, but at least I'm making a little bit of money there now. Okay, and with that, I'm going to go ahead and take a break here. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you next time.